Nitride semiconductors are known as materials for blue light emitting diodes and high power transistors where their unique characteristics are fully utilized. Nowadays, electronic parts composed of the nitride semiconductors are common in your daily life. Researchers at NTT Basic Research Laboratories have succeeded in developing an innovative process for lifting the nitride thin film devices from substrates. This newly developed process, dubbed the meter method, may further broaden the applicability of the nitride semiconductors. Gallium nitride is a typical nitride semiconductor. The gallium nitride based thin film devices are fabricated by processing the thin films together with single crystalline substrates. The role of the substrate is to support the thin film devices during the fabrication process. Some potential applications of the thin film devices remain elusive due to the substrates. A typical thickness of the substrates is a hundred times as large as that of the thin film devices, which deprive the devices of compactness and flexibility. If the thin film devices can be set apart from their host substrates and transferred onto any other substrates, the thin film devices may have a wider field of application. Considerable efforts have been put into the development of such detachment processes. Laser liftoff and chemical liftoff processes are examples of such detachment processes. However, these methods require either large-scale laser equipment or chemical processing using a large quantity of acid solutions. Another problem is that the detached thin film devices are not free from degradation. Here we show the newly developed process in the NTT basic research laboratories. The newly developed process involves the growth of an extremely thin layer of boron nitride between a sapphire substrate and the gallium nitride-based semiconductor. The boron nitride will be a release layer. Unlike the other nitride semiconductors, boron nitride takes a layered structure, same as graphite, and hence is cleavable. We developed a technique of growing a high-quality layered boron nitride thin film on the substrate and also growing high-quality gallium nitride-based thin films on the boron nitride. With this technology, semiconductor devices can be transferred without any laser beam machining or chemical treatment, either of which is required for the conventional methods. The released gallium nitride-based semiconductor devices are substantially thinner, lighter, and more flexible than conventional devices due to the substrates. As a result, for example, a gallium nitride-based thin film device can be transferred onto a red LED made of completely different material. This realizes an LED that can emit two different colors. An extremely thin LED can also be fabricated, which reduces the size of electrical components involving LEDs. The released gallium nitride-based semiconductor devices are transparent and ultraviolet sensitive. In addition, the newly developed process allows for less expensive, yet more scalable processing. Accordingly, using this process, a window-attached gallium nitride-based solar cell is a promising future application, as it can cut out hazardous UV light while generating power. <laughs>